A day after the governor announced the biggest vaccine incentive program in the nation, a pop-up vaccine site was set up at the busiest transit stop in San Diego. Both the cash prizes and the pop-up locations are meant to boost slowing vaccination numbers across California. So the question is, are those efforts making a difference so far? Our Jeff McAdams starts us off live with a look tonight. Jeff. Hey, Andrew, yeah, it's interesting out here at this pop up location today. We spoke to a few people and all but one of them said uh, Governor Gavin Newsom's vaccine announcement, the vaccine lottery yesterday. They say that perked their interest. It was part of the reason why they came down here today. That being said, the question is, will it be enough to get everybody in the door to get their shots? If you take public transportation around San Diego, there's a good chance you come right through here. Dolly. Uh, bus, bikes, cars, yeah, parking lots all around here. So this is a, a, this is one of the busiest areas. It's the busiest transit intersection in the entire county. A spokesperson for the county says that's exactly why they picked this place for their Friday pop-up vaccine clinic. You know what, where the people are, we will go. <laughs> the hope is for anybody riding the trolley, anybody walking by, um, Anybody in the neighborhood just to see us out here is to know that we're here to offer free vaccines. At this point, most people who want the vaccine have already gone out of their way to get one. Carrie, a volunteer with the county, hopes she might be able to wrangle in a few people who are still on the fence. I would say that the turnout has been pretty good as expected. Yeah. It's hard to convince people, you know, just when they get off a trolley to come and get something as you know, for some people as major as this. I don't know why there's hesitant, like, hesitance, like, with getting the shot. Count Jason Saldana among that crowd, hesitant to get the shot, but hearing that it's free, that there's no wait, and that he only has to get one shot was enough to convince him otherwise. Relief, I don't know, it's like a relieving feeling. Um, but I feel good. I don't know what I was afraid of. Yeah, again, and the lottery also a big uh, incentive out here today uh, that the county tells us they brought down 250 doses this morning, hoping they get through all of those today. They said they did have a surplus at the end of the day, so they didn't make it through all 250, Andrew. So as much of an interest, uh, this lottery that Governor Gavin Newsom has started announcing yesterday, it wasn't enough to get 250 people in here down here in San Diego this morning. From downtown San Diego, Jeff McGavin, Fox 5 News. See how it plays out in the days to come. All right, Jeff, thank you very much. Let's take a look at where we are right now. Overall, the latest numbers showing us more than one and a half million San Diegans are now fully vaccinated. It's nearly 54% of all San Diegans over the age of 12. Right now, the north central part of the county has the highest vaccination rate with about uh, 22%. The east county has the lowest with less than 13%.